when this lockdown happened initially, uh, people were asking, Sadhguru, how to manage, what to do? I told them, this much you must do. Whatever is your physical fitness, make it ten percent better. Your mental capabilities, ten percent better. Your emotional balance, ten percent better. Whatever is the nature of your work, your competence, ten percent better. This is the time to attend to many things that need attention but we've not been able to pay attention to. So let's make use of this time and uh, come out of this as better human beings. This uh, lockdown has been a great opportunity for me to really crank up my sadhana to a new level. We've been given, you know, certain sadhana to help boost our immunity and certain supports like that to help keep us healthy and we have this new uh, practice called Simha Kriya which increases your lung capacity, uh, which Sadhguru gave specifically for this purpose. I was very excited because after a long time, I think after five years, uh, we were going to go through such an intense sadhana uh, with Sadhguru's guidance. So I feel like just it's a step-by-step -step pro process for me and uh, every day I see that something is opening up. The natural elements, the way they are, this is the most significant aspect of one's growth if one wants to do Bhuta Shuddhi. All the practices that you're doing, whether it is Surya Kriya, Shakti Chalana Kriya, all of them are from the basis of Bhuta Shuddhi system. I want you to know the immensity of doing this sadhanas, which are essentially extracts from Bhuta Shuddhi with elements, strong elements. It's been really um, sort of a mind-blowing experience to be able to do my sadhana every day in such powerful spaces. I started getting up at like 3, 3.30 in the morning without an alarm and able to do five, six hours of sadhana nonstop. It's very hard to describe, but um, just feeling like you're melding into the elements there. And what I noticed for myself is after those days, you know, of intense weather, the body became so much more vibrant. Like so throughout the whole day, that vibrancy just stayed on. Exposing ourselves in the outside, be it sun or the wind or the rain, or in the evening, uh, especially uh, since April, we have been doing uh, Pournami chanting in the nights in front of Adiyogi between 8.30 to 10 o'clock. It's one of a very powerful situation that we are going through. When I opened my eyes and looked at Adiyogi after the chant was over, it was too much energy to contain. It was like something I have dropped there to never pick up again. The main thing that has impacted my sadhana is the guided asana sessions that they are conducting. You can see the difference between doing your sadhana on your own and with a lot of people, focus sadhana, and especially in the Adiyogi Alayam, which is consecrated for that purpose only. Just being in this space, it is so quiet, so silent. You just want to get into your sadhana and not come out at all. So getting my hands in the, in the soil and working there, uh, Sadhguru spoke that it would be very supportive in enhancing our immunity, uh, especially during these times. Recently in the last year I've had a few injuries that I've been struggling with long term and we started doing Pridvi Prema Seva. That uh, when I'm on the earth with my bare feet on the earth, then suddenly the pain seems to disappear for that period of time. So this has been a great kind of realization also that uh, of the importance of being in touch with the earth. In this last few months, the amount of changes that I have gone through has been really significant uh, in terms of the ease with which I am within myself, uh, the way I kind of look at things, the way I deal with things. It has been probably, I don't know, years of growth has happened in a few months is what I feel. 
So I did not feel that we were locked down. I feel that we just were given another opportunity, another tool to enhance ourselves and to make ourselves better human beings. Sadhana is a dimension. It's a tool, essentially. The word sadhana means a tool. But it is that kind of a tool which makes you intense, dynamic and conscious. So all the sadhana that you're doing essentially is in a way to capture little more life. But if you sit here, your little more life, if this becomes more life than the way it is right now, now in your awareness, that will be bigger than your body, that will be bigger than your thought, that will be bigger than your emotion because the life that you are has become big.